So today I want to share with you something about how I deal with insecurity. Because today there's just, just a shitload of insecurity running through me. Uh, basically it's about two things. First thing is feeling very insecure about my writings. Huh. I feel, I have these feelings that they are kind of spiritual, not too grounded. And then there are these thoughts that challenge me, that make me believe they don't add anything to the world. There are many other writers and so on and so on. The other insecurities, but people that there is this very deep fear in me that people don't don't see me, that I'll be forgotten as soon as they look another way, and especially with when I love someone, it's really easy to feel very insecure about their feelings towards me. I am important, especially when. Now I'm in an open relationship and the people I love also see other people. That's challenging me. Yeah. <laughs> so, what's basically happening today, it's not so much important why I feel insecure. The interesting thing is that I feel insecure and I can choose what to do with it. So if I look at my body, just simply observe what's going on. Then I feel there is um, a tension in the body, that my jaws are, the muscles in my face are kind of contracted. There is this adrenaline-like feeling th flowing through the body. And there is this tendency to constantly check Facebook or my phone, <laughs> if I still get likes on my posts, or if the people I think about message me to tell me how much they like me. <laughs> so what's happening besides the physical things is that there's this longing to reach outward, to reach for confirmation outside. So my center is not in me, my center is out there. It doesn't work, because if you don't feel beautiful, a thousand people can say you look beautiful and you won't believe it. Same goes for how I feel about my writings or about people who love. They can tell me a thousand times they love my writings. As long as I don't feel it, it's not working. So today, when these insecurities are running through me, I have two choices, I, as I see it. I can choose to let my thoughts make me small. Or I can use them as a way to grow. If I look at how I feel about my writings, I could tell myself, yes, indeed, there are many writers out there. And my writings don't add a single thing, which creates a huge writer's block. <laughs> I can think, well, maybe I shouldn't write. Or, <laughs> this insecurity is just a sign that it's time to take a step up. Yeah, maybe my writings were, up till now, a bit spiritual. Or at least some of them. Maybe my videos were not very grounded. So maybe it's time to change. Maybe it's time to add groundedness to my videos. To add more density or, you know, to add something to the writings. To make them better. The same goes for how I feel about myself. 
maybe I can use this feeling insecure just to observe my longing to reach outward to get confirmation as a sign to look inward what do I need? I know it doesn't work to look out because it makes me needy and greedy and uh, you gotta give it to me you gotta give me my confirmation and my self-love oh fuck that it's my responsibility to love me it's my responsibility to love me so f much that I don't need anyone else I don't need you That there is so much love in me, that there is so much I can share with you from abundance. So yeah, can I accept this insecurity inside of me? I can. Yeah. It's okay to feel insecure. It's okay to feel all over the place and not know where to go with these feelings. Just have to breathe observe and realize that this place of not knowing where to go because that's where I'm at it's a beautiful place because I can make new choices I cannot choose to write in a more, and talk in a more grounded way I cannot choose to love myself even more so I start sharing this video my underwear <laughs> my frizzy hair after a day <laughs> a long Easter day with family to transform these feelings of insecurity because they are energy and you can change energy in another form that's what I think and I feel it right now that this insecurity is still there. But while I'm talking to my phone, it's changing into something very powerful. It's creative energy as well. So let me use it. <laughs> Let's see where it goes. Thank you for watching this. I hope to see you again. <laughs>